I forgot to update the year. Man, fucking shitty ass streamer. Um, 1982. For some reason, Mame says this game came out in 1984, and I think that's what what threw me off. I had this in the list for 1984, and then I see the title screen, I'm like, it says 82. Why does Mame say 84? So this is a, an unreleased game that uh, Galloping Ghost actually has a cabinet of. Uh, whoop, that's not the image. That's not the image. Where is it? A game called Argus. Also known as uh, Protector. It uses a trackball and two buttons. So this is a uh, Superman inspired game, but had to change the uh, the identity of the uh, of the guy. But yeah, it also went under the name Protector. I like the, the the hand button. So they made like a, I think that's like a custom cabinet they made for uh, uh, to put this in a Galloping Ghost. Only place in the world you can play it. Yeah, there's a there's a game by NMK called uh, called Argus, but yeah, we'll we'll probably be looking at that when it uh, when we get to it. But that was like '86. So it's definitely confusing having uh, having another game with the same name. Not the first time it's happened. There were two games called Victory. Uh, might have happened again on something else. Also, the uh, uh, the side art they made for this was definitely not the side art that was originally planned for the cabinet because uh, uh, that's Minmo. That's some uh, that's some Minmo they chose for that uh, for that side art. <laughs> Why me? Whatever, he's no wax man. Oh yeah, two gladiators. I got the Galloping Ghost logo up there. Custom cab for Galloping Ghost. Yeah, it's uh, it's G Sun Man. Great, Sun Man. Oh, that's the wrong game. Hold on. Argus G. That's the yeah. So see, you can see it uh, from the uh, the title screen or the the info page here. It says 1984, and then when you get to the title screen, it says 82. That's a crawl sound effect. Press catch button. So you have to... It's kind of like Defender. You have to save people. Shoot blobs on ground from above. The demo is not... Uh... Oh. Shoot villains and hats with energy bolts. Hold down catch button to rescue falling citizens and catch flying cars. Shoot or catch rubble before it crushes. Oh, okay. So basically, your lives in this game are the number of civilians. Because Argus is invincible. Damn, there he is. Also, he's bongo colored. Okay, so I don't know if my. Uh, if my control scheme is working great, I'll just like play this on pad. <laughs> I'm not using a mouse on this. He's wearing a bucket on his head to cover his identity. Obviously. Uh, okay, shoot. Hold down catch button. Game ends when no citizens remain. Extra citizen awarded every 30,000 points. The kidnapper, the wrecker, and the pest. Okay. Meow. So yeah, that's the same level transition noise from uh, Kroll. I guess this came first and they just reused it. Uh, uh, uh. 
time bones. <laughs> that one guy was keep was doing the keep on trucking pose. Uh oh, catch the rubble. You can actually shoot the rubble. <coughs> so you can only have one shot on the screen at a time. Hey. Hey, hey. Leave my people alone. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, we're on the bridge now. Oh, they're firing the, the lasers now. Yeah, you can fly into the enemies. You're invincible. Because the whole the whole objective here is to save... is to keep the people from... Oh, God. Oh, okay. Just keep the people from dying. Oh, he got zapped! No, no, ah! I lost two of my citizens. Those fucking bolts are cheap. Man, they're sniping. No, okay. The first couple stages are pretty easy, and then it gets a little... starting to get a little more unmanageable. Ah! <coughs> fucking... okay. So, I don't know, as far as unreleased games go... This isn't that bad, you know? It's a neat concept. Uh-oh. Oh, you gotta catch the people when they fall from a high distance. It's like the fender. Hey, 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 hey. Ah! Maybe I do gotta play on mouse, I don't know. <laughs> I get that extend at 30,000. Yeah, it probably feels a lot better than... Uh, feels a lot better with trackball. I should have played this at Galloping Ghost when I had the chance. Oh, splat! Okay. You gotta actually capture the citizen if they fall from a, a high distance, huh? <laughs> Bulldozer comes out to move the rocks away. That's pretty good. I'm gonna say if they if they run into stationary rocks, do they die? No. Ah! Game over. How did I get 117,000? Legally distinct, not the Superman theme. Yeah, maybe I played on mouse? I don't know. It doesn't play very well on the on the digital control. But mm, the thing is you can still only fire in like eight directions. I'll play one more credit. Bum 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 bum. How do I skip this? There we go. Yeah, maybe they were afraid of getting sued. I don't know. <laughs> if you run into the building, you get stuck for a second. Ugh, my head. But yeah, I don't know. This is alright. Might not have set the world on fire, but... If it had come out, but... It's pretty playable. It's a decent concept. Maybe this game deserved a chance. Hey, hey. No! Got fried. I wish you could fire more than one shot at a time. Wait, I thought somebody died. 
But I still have six. Okay, I guess I didn't lose one then. Alright. Don't question it. Oh, they just get stuck there or something. Yeah, I, I guess the first civilian's at 20,000 and then it's every 30 after? I don't know. I thought it was every 32, though, yeah. Because only being able to fire one shot at a time makes it, like, really hard to hit some of these enemies. But I guess it would have been too easy if you could have, uh, just pepper the screen with gunfire all the time. What was wrong with that lady's legs on the left? She's doing a big steppy. Oh my god, this fucking UFO! No, no, no! I tried to save him! No, it's extra life every 20,000 then. Alright. Fuck. Man, once this UFO gets started, I can't... I can't deal with it. <laughs> it's like it's dropping shots I have to hit on the ground, but I can't hit the UFO. Okay, by round seven, you're already back to the first stage, so that's like a full loop. That's, But obviously, this is harder. There's more, more enemies. So there wasn't, like, much programmed into the game. Oh, there's enemies on the ground now, too. They are introducing new stuff. This is more and more shit to keep track of. Pew, 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 pew. Hey, hey. Out for the car. Somehow I did. Oh god. Barely blocked that. It's so hard to hit these fucking guys. <laughs> they're good. The robots aren't even, like, doing anything. Unless they're the ones that are, like, launching them into the air. They're just kind of vibing. Oh, splat! First time they actually hit with the rocks. Yeah, that's what they're doing. Fucking shoot this! It's so hard to fucking hit these enemies sometimes. Oh, there's a new stage, USA. Never mind, we weren't at the at the loop yet. That's the, the space shuttle from the end of uh, Chimera Beast. They're all trying to escape Earth from the, the Eater. I saved them! Bullshit. Okay. Or it's the Tetra shuttle, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, look at the astronaut! That was pretty sick. Yeah, the space shuttle. My bad. Get the spelling right. Oh, we got fried. Fuck. Nice try, Bongo Man. Man, I must have had one hell of a one hell of a run on this in uh, in Mame Roulette, huh? I don't remember if there was, like, any other stages after that.
Oh, uh, yeah. There's no way I'm not covering Chimera Beast when the time comes. You bet your ass. That's for my ass. <laughs> well, yeah, I do think this game... I think this game did deserve a shot. It's, uh... It's got a neat concept. It's kind of fun to play. I would say... I wish, uh... I wish you had more firepower. Like, it's kind of it's kind of frustrating not being able to, uh... Or only being able to fire one shot at a time, I mean. It makes it, uh... makes it really hard to deal with enemies. And, like, they, they throw a lot of shit at you. Like, you'll have three different enemies, and there's a saucer dropping those... Those lava blobs that you gotta stop, or else they start frying the... The hostages. The civilians, whatever. There's a, there's a lot of shit to keep track of, but that makes it interesting, right? Yeah, they released Cubert Cubes, for, for God's sake. <laughs> I'd play this over Cubert's Cubes. But yeah, I guess that's the other problem with, like, that, that Superman games always have, is that you're making a game about, like, a character that's practically invincible unless he comes into contact with Kryptonite. So how do you make a... How do you make a game where, like, Superman can fail? And in this game, it's... You gotta protect people. And if you don't protect enough people, then... I guess it's not Superman, but... Argus goes to his shame cube, I guess. So that's one way to do a Superman-style game with an invincible hero. Anyway, 62% gave it a 3. A lot of 4s. People fans of the concept. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can quite give it a 4, but... I think 3 is fair enough. I think it's a it's a good concept. Maybe not the Maybe not the best execution, but it's... I think it's worth a shot. I think it. I think it deserved uh, to get a release. IMO. Dude, Superman's a wuss in the in the Taito arcade game. Everybody beats the shit out of him. Those girls with the bunny ears just like they kick him in the shin. He loses half his life. Like, damn. You're a wuss, Superman. I think I accidentally froze the thing. <laughs> okay, let me do some... quick art catch-up. Should have been doing that during the... thing. Also, I think I'm going to use the restroom after after this. Just drain the lizard. Okay. The Man of Aluminum. Uh, where is it? Thank you, Clip It, for, uh... <laughs> All my cubes gone. Who were those blue guys with the trampoline? They never explained that part. <laughs> In the lore. Thank you for that. And we got a Three Stooges piece. Where'd it go? 
There it is. <laughs> Destroy the furniture. We need to get the uh, the Leston Constellan guy out on the uh, on this one. Thank you for that clip it. And thank you, Chubo, for <laughs> tiny, tiny baseball men. Excellent. Oh boy. <laughs> They're just little guys. Thank you for that, Chubo. Thank you for that. For those two, clip it. Uh, I'm just gonna, gonna stand up and use the uh, the restroom real quick. Just be a couple minutes. I'll just I'll just leave it on this screen. Fuck it. <laughs> Who cares? Let's turn this up for a second. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> 